Peace family, it is day five of Change Your Narrative, and I really appreciate you for being here with me and for me and continuously showing up. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe to the YouTube Seeded Fruit channel and share this video with anyone that you feel can benefit from it. So one of the things that I need you, absolutely need you, need you to know and realize is that our narrative, our self-talk is training our expectation. And we get what we expect. There's so much power in expectation. Right? So when you participate in the bottom of the barrel behavior, baby, you're going to get bottom of the barrel results. When your conversation and your self-talk is on the bottom of the barrel level, baby, again, those are the results that you are going to get. One of the conversations that people have often, and sometimes you may think it's cute or bandwagonish. And people will say things like, well, you know, when I get, you know, at the end of my paycheck or at the end of the week when I get paid, all my I might not have no money, but all my bills are paid and I got food in the house. As if that's really a big thing. And for some, it may be. However, if you keep even joking around, being partially serious, or whatever like that's what you're going to keep getting because you're training your expectation to the point of you not having any money or it being okay to not have any money after your paycheck as long as all of your bills are paid and you got food in the house that doesn't leave room for anything else baby that's barely enough and so your expectation is at least at the end of this week or at at least at the end of this pay period that I can have I can have all my bills paid and food in the house. Some of y'all are okay with not having no money after that. And that's your expectation because your narrative, your self-talk is trained to that. So, and it's okay, baby, to speak a thing into existence. It's okay to call those things that are not as though they are. These are for these faith walkers, right? So it's, it's, it's okay to say things like, Man, at the after after I get paid, all of my bills, my, my monthly living expenses are taken care of. Honey, I got food in, in my house. I got plenty of money to play with. If I want to go anywhere and do anything, I can do that. I have plenty of money to invest in something that's going to bring me more money. I got plenty of money left over after every pay period. Those are some of the things that you can begin to say. That's how you can change your narrative on that. And then also in simultaneously be, be redirecting your expectation, right? That expectation almost is like that strong emotion that you be, that you have. So also remember that your narrative baby is, is directing your expectation and you get what you expect not what you want not what you need but what you expect if you expect to be treated a certain way in a relationship good bad or indifferent baby that's what you're gonna get but if on the inside of you like that inner you that that inner person treat your expectation like it's a person and watch and see how differently things turn out for you. Practice it. I do. I have for a long time. I can tell y'all so many stories. Honey, y'all will be sick of me, I promise you. Just just even the other day, like there's a certain type of treatment, baby, that I expect and I get it all the time. Oh, mm -mm. Auntie, don't participate in bottom of the barrel behavior because ain't nothing at the bottom of the barrel that I am interested in. So I don't even I don't even play them kind of games. But I wanted to leave that with you for day five. Your narrative changes and directs your expectation and you get what you expect. I love you. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.